welcome back to my channel this is Ace Orana you probably have noticed the change on my introduction because today I'm officially launching the new name of this segment from being piece of cake to now is that cake the reason behind it well, it's obvious. It's my name is Ace Orana. That's all there is to it. And we have a Facebook group. I'll put the link on the description below if you want to share your tips and experiences in baking, in cake decorating. Feel, please feel free to join. Um, and let's all learn together. Today, I'm sharing with you a, reci a recipe that I came up with. Actually, it is from a numerous attempt of making sugar-free French macaron. I had so many, so many failure doing that. And that's how I came up with this recipe. And I call it sugar-free macaron cookie sandwich. I call it a sandwich it's because you're, it's like the French macaron actually that you're sandwiching the filling at the middle. It's a cookie and my kids love this. So let's get started! We will be needing 100 grams of almond flour, 100 grams of swerve powdered sugar, 1 4 cup of stevia sugar, 70 grams of egg whites, that's about 2 large eggs. We will also be needing salt and optional are cream of tartar and gel food coloring. And then for the frosting, you can actually use any frosting you want, but for today we will be doing chocolate ganache as our frosting which is also sugar free, free because i'll be using Corista semi-sweet chocolate chips we will need 100 grams of Corista semi-sweet chocolate chips and about 65 ml of heavy cream so let's start by mixing our almond flour and swirl powdered sugar together on a blender or a food processor if you have one So that's about 30 seconds. We will set this aside. Then we will continue by beating our egg whites, cream of tartar, and salt. So after beating the egg whites for about three minutes, we will add in our sugar slowly. I would suggest dividing it into three parts. So once we get the stiff peak, we can add in our colors and then we will beat this on a slow speed. I'm using an ivory color because I want it to be a little beige. We're gonna add in our almond flour and powdered sugar mixture and we'll add it slowly by folding with our rubber spatula. We're gonna put it in our piping bag and I'm you, you want to use a circle tip. This one is actually um, tip 12 of Wilton. And we will bake this into the preheated oven at 300 degree Fahrenheit for about 18 to 20 minutes. Let's do this. oven and let it cool onto this rack for about 15 to 20 minutes then we're gonna put some fillings in it to make it a sandwich you can put your filling in a piping bag or just scoop it right to the cookie and so this is it to run my sugar-free macaron cookie sandwich i would suggest after filling your frosting let it sit for a while for about five to ten minutes so that your frosting settles before you serve it and when if there's some left over you can put it in the fridge and serve it for another day so let's do a taste test today mm.
really good so i hope you get to try this if you do please let me know what you think put your comments below let me know what you think let me know what your kids think about it my kids really love this well actually my eldest son really love this and most importantly guys it's sugar free so no guilt about giving it to your kids as a snack and that's it for today guys thank you so much once again for watching and please don't forget to subscribe hit the bell button and hit the like button for this video please don't forget stay safe guys stay home and stay safe know that we will get through this pandemic together the lord is with us he will never leave us nor forsake us thank you guys see you next time god bless you all bye